Investigative sports scientist Jim Shaughnessy set out to reveal the specific changes Novak Djokovic made to his serve, which catapulted Djokovic to number one in the world and made sports history. In 2009, Novak Djokovic was ranked third in the world, a ranking he had held for three years, a ranking he could not fight his way past. His career overshadowed by the dramatic rivalry between Rafael Nadal and Roger Federer, his choice was to remain at number three or dare a risky change which could cost him millions in prize money and his current world ranking. It was a big risk. In August 2009, Djokovic hired a serve coach and began his struggle to change his serve. Frustration and embarrassment ensued. He made no improvement in world rankings. He became discouraged. He separated from his serve coach. He threatened to give up his quest for better service technique, and he went on a 10-tournament losing streak which threatened his number three world ranking. But in December of 2010, something dramatically changed. A 43-match winning streak. The risk paid off. Djokovic not only gained the coveted number one ranking and dominance on the world stage, but a place in sports history. How did this happen? Investigative sports scientist Jim Shaughnessy set out to find out. For years, Shaughnessy had built a three-dimensional video library of top sports performers for comparative analysis. He had in his library three-dimensional models and video of Djokovic's serve in 2009 through 2011, before, during, and after the change. Data which could be accurately quantified, explored, and examined. With the help of modern technology and science, Shaughnessy was able to unveil changes that could not be perceived with even the slowest motion video. Changes that no one else could see. Changes that made the difference. Through this research into what actually happened on the court, Shaughnessy came to understand how and why the Djokovic dare paid off. James R. Shaughnessy, MS, investigative sports scientist, motion analyst, USTA high-performance coach, founder of Sio Sports.